myself muted, but I opened TikTok and the sound was on full blast. <laughs> I jump scared myself. I go Bobo. <laughs> oh my god. I keep on getting like Twitter lives and then TikTok lives of like supposed Oilers sending people money on like PayPal and shit, but I can't help to think that they're actually a scam. That, that's another reason why I personally chose to disable um, third party donations is because like I genuinely can't afford if somebody charges me back. Like that, that is a non option. And I didn't get many, um, labs donations anyway, so it doesn't really matter in my opinion. I'd rather get bits. Because even if the chargeback fee is like $10, it's like, that's still minus $10. That's like a bubble tea. Fake donations are so dumb. I know, I keep on getting baited. Cause it'll show the the oiler having like a million dollars in his paypal and he's just like sending people like a thousand dollars and i'm like that that's like too good to be true it's like i want an actual sugar daddy okay anyway i'm gonna check one more time if the audio synced Okay, it is. Because sometimes I need to dock the switch or leave it. Sometimes I have to re dock it, so I don't know. No sick. I really need to redo my nails, they look so bad. I'll turn face cam on for like a second. They're so bad. I don't know what color I want to do though. I'm thinking red. But also, it's almost Halloween, so I should be doing orange. I really want to do a stream when I try when I try like all the pumpkin spice flavored shit. Cause I know McDonald's, Wendy's, Starbucks. Those are the only real fast food chains I've seen that has like pumpkin flavors right now. Also, those are just the fast food places I go to. <laughs> Everywhere else is kind of bad. But there's like, that'd be so much sugar in one sitting. And knowing me, I love sugar, so I would just like eat it all. Anyway, guys, face came on in three, two, one. Yo, I'm live. Good morning, good afternoon. Hope everyone is doing well today. I'm live on time, if not early. So, haters, you cannot say that I'm late. But good morning. Thank you to Kobobo for chatting the Just Starting Soon screen. Thank you. Today, the plan is simple. We are going to be continuing our playthrough of Spirit Fair. This is a... What'd you call it? I guess it's a more story-based game. I like the dialogue bits. I just want to hear the lore. You know, that's what I want. Hi, Wheel. Welcome in. Can we get some yos? Hello. I need to stop looking at myself in my OBS. It's cringe. Okay, I think I need to remember the voices that I did. I know the, the dear lady who has sounded more proper. The toad was, like, all boisterous, and the snake was more, like, kind of chipper, kind of slimy sounding. Okay, let's go. I love gaming. 
<laughs> Wait, can I talk about something really quick? Okay, guys, guys. Um, follow my Twitter. I, <laughs> I, I, I notice that I only really tweet whenever I go live or when I like post something about editing, and that's kind of cringe. So, I need to start posting like more random shit. So, oh, I went to the doctor yesterday. Update. Um, my doctor said I should seriously consider brain surgery. Smile. Anyway, where is it? Twitter. So this was like, I've been thinking about how to phrase this for a while. That, that ain't it. <laughs> that is not it. Here it is. <laughs> okay, I'll read it out loud for the audio listeners. Sometimes I wish my chronic illness started sooner. I could have used my Make-A-Wish to meet Markiplier or something. I thought this was funny. But I got a few comments. I got one DM saying, It's okay, Peason, it's okay. I meant it to be funny. I thought it was hilarious. In my head, it was funny, okay? Also, to clarify, chronic illness means you're gonna have it for your life. Terminal illness means you're probably gonna die. There's a big difference. Both suck, but term I don't have a terminal illness. I'd be fine. I'm just gonna be, like, in pain my whole life. Like, it's fine. But I'm I'm okay. <laughs> like that was one of my like funnier thoughts I had. And nobody thought it was funny. <laughs> I mean we all have different ways to cope, right? Um let's play the game. I love Spirit Fair. I'm only four percent done. Oh no. You thought the tweet was sad too? Dude! I have a way sadder one that I've been drafting out of my head. Cause, um, I went to the doctor's yesterday, right? And it's a neurology specialist clinic. So it's a lot of people, a lot of elderly people, people in like wheelchairs or with canes. Because usually it's normal to have like arthritis and shit when you're old. But me being 24 and like having a a uh, birth defect is kind of like it feels like I'm not supposed to be here and I get really sad whenever I go but it's fine you know at least I have access to healthcare cuz I'm a brokey <clears throat> oh how about a little snack Stella I'm feeling quite hungry Oh, thank you. I was quite hungry. <laughs> Why is he shaking his ass? Holy. Hi, Gio. Welcome in. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Anyway, guys, I feel fine today. Yesterday, I was... I got McDonald's and I got a crumble. Okay, another thing I was drafting out of my head. Um, I'm a huge Michaels fan, okay? I love Michaels. I love walking through it. It makes me feel good. I know Hobby Lobby hates the gays, but I love Hobby Lobby. I've refused to go for years, but there's like two in my town. I live in a pretty big town. So there's two Hobby Lobbies, and I've refused to go for the whole year that we've been living here. And I finally went. Oh my god, there's so much good shit. Because I wanted to get... Since I finally got my, um, my carving tools, I can start carving starving camps, stamps again. So, I got a, I got a couple ink pads, I got some embossing powders. And it was only like $30, when if I would have bought everything at Michael's, it probably would have been like 50 Michael's has so many coupons, yeah, and I'm on the rewards program, so I get like a $5 credit every month. Hobby Lobby hates the gays. It's kind of like the Chick-fil-A where, like, the executives don't like queer people. And there's a lot of, like, faith rhetoric in a lot of the products at Hobby Lobby. But... It's a lot cheaper than Michael's. Oh, wait, I gotta figure out where to go. <clears throat> I go to Hobby Lobby all the time. Okay, then you would see, like, every single aisle has, like, some faith-related product, where it's like, Follow your heart and your faith. 
Who's this guy? Quartz Dragon, huh? Oh my god, I understand. Now, Geo having an epiphany right now. <laughs> oh my god, that's hilarious. <clears throat> and then I got some stickers for my sister. Oh, good morning, honeybee. Can I give you a hug? Oh, cute. Oh, you're so sweet. Well, if it rains, I don't need to water. Makes sense. You didn't know either? Bruh. I mean, the only reason I know is because I saw memes all over online like a year ago. Unless they've changed. I don't know. Oh, are we here? That was quick. Quick. Every time I go to Hobby Lobby, it's full of old white people. Dude, I saw no POC at the Hobby Lobby. <laughs> and in my city, it's very diverse. Like, there's like very little white people here. But the Hobby Lobby was full of white people. <laughs> okay. Copper. I love copper. <clears throat> Ooh, another lost soul. Hey. I came here to cut down these trees, but I forgot Ooh. my axe. I'm not gonna start using someone else's axe. That would be strange. I like the way my axe feels. It's so sturdy and it calms me. Oh, I missed that axe. I've been passing the time by writing letters and throwing some in the water. I've been writing poetry. It's not very good. But I'm getting better. Hopefully no one finds my terrible poetry. Dude, just uncle freaking out over here. Wow, berries. Are berries your favorite uncle? The service on this ship is incredible. Okay, I forgot how to dive. Okay, it's down and B. Directional down B. Ooh, a valuable ring. These look incredible. I was just dreaming about these. The cat looks like the one from Aristocats. I want to watch Aristocats again. But isn't that like kind of bad now? I Okay. A lot of older Disney movies are kind of bad. Like, I've seen a few people, like, reacting to the disclaimers that they'll have now. <laughs> Where they're like, some of the imagery does not represent the values of current Disney. And then it has, like, the Siamese cats from Aristocats. <laughs> Why did I forget my axe? I'm lost without it. 
that all I'm supposed to do here? Oh wait, this was not the mission island. It was a resource island. I forgot. Classic Beeson. I'm supposed to go here. The Quartz Dragon. Will I ever do a Prime movie night again? Um, maybe. Oh, wait, actually, I can't. I don't have a Prime account anymore. <laughs> I forgot. I don't have Prime anymore, so no. Why is she saying quick? Quick. I just couldn't explain it at first, but then it hit me. I'm starving. Oh. So we mustn't. Hmm. No, sorry, Stella. You know I can't eat fruit for the life of me. I tried, but I just can't. Okay, I'm sorry. I'll get you some coffee. Oh, this. I thought that might be it. The dragon. I guess it is inevitable that I would be here. <clears throat> Following me always, even in this world. Our destinies, well, they're intertwined, are they not? Still, for all the harm it has done me, it looks quite in pain, doesn't it? The rocks on its back seem to be oozing with corruption. Perhaps chipping away at them might soothe it. Go ahead, Stella. All creatures deserve love and care. Do what you do best. Hmm. <laughs> I'm only trying to help. Damn, this guy is huge. Kingdom, no. <laughs> she has like 170 hours, but she's just stalling. Oh, what? Oh, come on. Okay, so that one just perpetually falls. Ask her like, oh, have you saved Zelda yet? She's like, no. And I'm like, oh, she's dead now. <laughs> and she's just like, whatever. Incredible. It looks relieved, doesn't it? I wonder what it means. If we ever to cross this dragon's path again, I think we should help it. However I might feel about it, for now. For now, though, I need some time to collect my thoughts. Thank you, Stella, for everything. I'm 
really excited for when we get to like see the deeper meaning to all the imagery in the game. I cannot wait. Like, what does the dragon mean to the snake? Hey, Sprout. There seems to be quite a few new faces aboard. I like it. Don't get me wrong. I just don't want you to forget about your old uncle Atul. You know me, I'm Mr. Personality. I can get along with anyone, anywhere, anytime. I just didn't think I'd have to make new friends at my age. You don't have to worry. I'll be alright. Sorry I even brought it up. I'll just scan- I'll just go stand on the edge of the boat and take in this splendor, you know? Hopefully no bugs will fly in my mouth. That's no fun. But you're a frog, you love bugs. This game is super unique. Yeah, I don't know why I didn't play it sooner. Because I've had a few chatters recommended. I just had been holding off on it. Oh. I hate using the oven. It scares me sometimes. Easy. Oh wait, I should have some coffee beans. stuff with oil is much more scary stop don't remind me <laughs> the one good thing about my hands having less sensitivity is like when I use when I like pan fry stuff I don't feel the oil splatters anymore because today I made um Mongolian beef it was sauce from the mix but I had to pan fry or pan sear the beef before so my hands got all, like, a whole bunch of oil on it. But I was looking at it, I was like, oh, I don't feel anything. This is kind of nice. Please, I can't eat something twice. I don't hate myself that much. Stop! Okay, I know she Ooh. likes popcorn, though. Oh, thank you, Stella. I love comfort food so damn much. Okay, so I think whenever they're hungry, the food icon is like an apple core, but see how she just got fed and the apple is full? Mm. Now I know. I don't want to sound picky, but I've eaten this very recently. Don't you have anything else? Oh, thank you. I was quite hungry. Jeez, everybody's so picky. Picky, picky. What happens if they starve? They die. <laughs> no, I think they just get really cranky. Because this is technically the boat to the underworld anyway, so... I guess it would just be expediating their time of death. Let's see, where to next? Hmm. mission or not um oh it's too dark to navigate nice i think the mission was the dragon thing I 
wish it would stop raining. Ooh, not gonna lie, I love fall time. Because yesterday when I was out about it was raining, so I got to finally wear my raincoat again. And it's the cool black one that has like the rainbow stripe pattern on the side. And I was like, ooh, this is what Washington is supposed to be. Okay, I think I'm gonna go to all these three resource islands, go to here to see if I, I can upgrade the boat. And then maybe explore here. Is that- I don't know if that's the edge of the map or just a new area. Because I don't think I have any main missions right now. Good morning, Sprout. Did you know that you can catch different fish when it rains? Maybe they like to go up to drink the fresh water that's dripping down. Pretty neat, right? Okay, I'll get the fish in then, sir. Thank god, finally. Oh my god. <laughs> is that how annoying, like, real fishing is? But you know what's not annoying? Um, following the channel, because everybody, we are 30 minutes in the stream, so if we do here, follow! You get cool emotes and the ability to dive in chat. I was hungry as usual, so I did something about it. I went outside the boat and gathered some berries, but I went a little overboard. I have too much. Here you go. Have a wonderful day. Hey, that was nice. A snack would be great right now. Uh, now that's what I call a perfect blend of coffee. That hits the spot. Man, everybody's so hungry all the time. Oh, thank you. I was quite hungry. Yeah, I'm gonna set course for the next place and then water the plants. Mm -hmm. 
Stella? I hope the resources necessary to build my house aren't too hard to come by. Oh yeah, I gotta build her a house. Oopsie. <laughs> I kind of forgot. Lodge. Contains all the luxury amenities Gwen needs to survive on the high seas. Logs and limestone. I have all of them. Damn! Her place is huge! There we go. Oh, Kinas. Jump down. different plane I can't access it properly okay I, I don't think I can access it It. The cabin is outstanding. It really does wonders to have a place of your own. Doesn't it remind you of my old condo on Waverly? Probably the only place where I could get some peace and quiet. Thank you, old friend. Well, Stella, I'm sure you remember my old sewing machine. It was a diva. It was a diva with gold lettering and a manual wheel. You know, I've always been into textiles. Well, a few years ago, I went to a museum which had tons of different sorts of fabric crafting machines. And I couldn't help but notice that you could build a loom on this ship. That would be a great opportunity to teach you a, a few tricks. And I'm quite sure you'll need thread and fabric soon. So you should definitely add a loom to this boat. The resources for it should be easy to find. Just check in your blueprint table. See, now everybody else is going to be jealous that she has her own house. Hey, Sprout. I took a look at your blueprint station. It's nice, I suppose. But you know what would make it even greater? More plans, bigger buildings, better pencils. I'm just saying. I'm sure Albert at Albert Shipyard can help you out. Oh, I was, I was, I'm literally here, man. I'm on it. I'm being proactive. Oh, I guess I don't have the loom unlocked yet. Yeah, I don't. Hmm. 
Wait, am I not here? Oh, I... <laughs> I'm off by like a few feet. Oopsie. Hey, it's this guy again. right here okay so I was just in the wrong spot hello there young lady I guess you must be the new spirit fair happy to make your acquaintance I'm Francis you can say I'm a sort of wandering merchant see I'm very fond of things objects curios trockies I just buy everything Simply put, I'll buy anything you don't want anymore. I'm sure you've come across a few valuable treasures already. So tell me, what is it you want to part with? An old shoe, old carpet, a valuable ring. Oh, the ring should be sold, okay. Fiber necklace should be sold, okay. What kind of animal is this one? He looks like an onion. Okay, I think I got better prices. Or no, the herring was the same 15, so maybe it's just the same rate. Okay, I'm gonna sell the things that say should be sold. Okay, should be sold. Soggy and smelly. I'll sell a handful of shoes. I'm up 2k, holy moly. I gave him this necklace. Dude, he's scamming. Carpet for two thousand dollars. He literally gave you like a hundred bucks. This guy sucks. Ooh, odd seed. I'll take both. We hate this guy. Errands. Daily quest. Oh no, it's like Animal Crossing. I'm immensely chipper to see a dynamic young lady being so hard at work. Not that Sharon wasn't a true professional, but his manners were, well, a bit cold, if you know what I mean. And he kept everything he found. What a pity. But you're here now. Huzzah, if I dare say. Oh, and don't fret, budding mariner. If ever needed, old Francis will never be too far. But don't let me be impedient. Wait. But don't let me be an impediment to your appetite for adventure. Go on, set sail, little blue jacket. A word, please, Stella. I don't know if you've noticed, but I've been very tired recently. And I'm afraid to say that it's starting to weigh on my morale. I don't want to sound ungrateful, but I think the guest house, as lovely as it might be, not be, might not be very good for me. It's a bit too noisy and quite cramped. I hate to ask you this, really, but could you maybe arrange for me to have a little private space on the boat? I think it would help me tremendously. And then we could continue our lessons. But nothing, nothing too fancy. Just a place to sleep and meditate. 
with less greenery, perhaps. Oh, and I'd be delighted if it had natural stones. Yes, that would be splendid. Thank you again, Stella. Deeply. Damn, everybody just wants their own house. Limestone and oak. Homo, how? Okay, limestone I get from the random excursions and oak plank. I don't know. Or well, probably trees, I guess. But I don't. I've only gotten logs. I don't think I've ever had planks. Hmm. These I too. Hmm. Let's see if we can upgrade the ship. Bella! I've been getting your mail here for the past month. I'm not a post office. You need to add a mailbox to your boat. If I get one more little letter filled with glitter, I'll lose it. I'm warning you. You might be a customer, but I reserve the right to yell at you. Get it done. Okay. I don't have a maple plank. Okay, so I think I should focus on unlocking all the blueprints. Because to unlock future things, because for this one I get aluminous almost, so I assume that's how I make um, thread and planks. I'll do this first. Hi, Keelan. Can we get some yo's? And then I'll get, because I have 2k, I'll, I'll get more space. Yeah, I need to make refined, it's gonna, I always say ingredients, I need to make refined objects now. Okay. I have everything that I need to make refined stuff now. I heard they just fired an employee at the popcorn factory. He was a good worker. But they found him sleeping on the cob. <laughs> that was pretty good, man. I'll take it. I think I want to rearrange a tad. Or oh, I should navigate first when it's still bright. I need to rearrange. I personally don't like when the buildings are stacked. It's kind of hard. I like where everything is just on the same level. So let's rearrange a tad. I think I want to move the houses to the far right because I don't go on the right side as much. Put gardens on the bottom. Oh. Um, hold. Perfecto. Okay. 
there, so she won't complain about her house being like cut in half. Okay, I think this will be slightly easier for me to navigate. for the jellies. I'm going bananas on this ship. I don't have anything to do. I've got this surplus of energy. I need to get my hands busy. Can you do me a solid? You've always been my favorite niece, you know that. I think I need a place to focus that energy. In a sawmill. Yeah. You're just missing some of the key components. Materials. Which I'm sure you can find on nearby islands. I'm counting on you to help me out. I'm sure you don't want your old uncle to sleep on the deck. <laughs> right? No, sir. On it, boss. I have everything for the loom. Oh my god, it's huge. Okay, foundry, I need plank and coal. Okay, so I need the loom to make thread. Got it. Jellyfish. Here they come again. Hmm, I don't feel great. Go, I still have faith in you. I'll watch from inside. Don't be scared, Stella. They'll be coming straight for us. No need to fear, for I am here. Mm. Oh, I can't access the crops. Oh, I have a double jump, I forgot. Nice. I'm waking everybody up, sorry.
all right. This loom looks fantastic. Don't be scared. It's in perfect working order. Let me show you how it works. You put fiber inside and then you spin. You just have to make sure you hit the target. And you get a little extra if you hit the marker needle. See? Pretty easy, right? Now you try it. Try it with this fiber. Good job. You have to hold A and then you release and press. There's a little mini game for each little task. Good job. See, it's not that hard. The machine does all the work, you just have to flow with it. And that's what makes this so soothing. The rhythm, the sound, the feel of it. Utterly satisfying. I'll probably give it a go at it myself when you don't need it. But don't worry about the materials, I'll manage. Nice. I think the audio is decent, really? Okay, thank you for telling me. Let us double check. <laughs> okay, it should be fixed now. Thank you for telling me, Wheel. So maybe... Hmm. Because I didn't redock the switch after I started. So maybe I should just, by default, redock my switch right at the start. But thank you. It's synced now. I still don't know why it keeps desyncing randomly. Because the issue fixed itself after I upgraded, like, the actual capture card, but everything is fully updated. So it could be just, like, an OBS issue again. Which is a big L! Hey, Sprout. You've upgraded your boat! Hmm, that's weird. Don't tell Albert, but he left some bolts loose. He was probably just in a hurry. Give me a second. Here we go. Zooey mama. <laughs> that did more than I thought. Let's see here. Whoa, this boat's got some advanced options now. First up, you can travel safely and not go all through the dangers the sea has to offer. When you're using your map, just you just need to toggle on safe travel mode. It's that simple. And don't worry, it won't stay on forever. Next time you select a destination, it won't be on. I hope that helps. What else do we have here? Oh yeah, the engine's been boosted. You can now set multiple destination points. Ooh! That's pretty handy. That's actually kind of nice. It is kind of annoying to reset every time. You can set your course and let the wind do its job. Besides that, it's just a bigger boat with more room. Well, have fun. Epic. I want to go here. Did I do it wrong? Oh, set waypoint. Um, can I reset? <laughs> okay, right here. Got it. Okay, so waypoint is like the pit stops you want to make. Can 
I want to go here. Now I'm good. Hi, Chip. Welcome in. Can we get some yo's? You know, you're supposed to work or watch the stream on the company now. That's how it's supposed to go. Boss makes a dollar, you make a dime. Yeah, it could also be because I'm streaming from a laptop, like, I don't have, like, a hardwired capture card. Because if you have, um, like, a hard drive, then you can get, like, one of those, it looks like a little chip for a capture card. I just use the USB cords. So that could be an, an issue. People usually have issues more so with the cables than the chips. But it's fine. It just be like that. I promise, when I get my million dollar mansion, I will get an actual PC. Okay, so if I'm gonna do the waypoint one, I have to make sure I get off the ship. <laughs> I know when I get back on, I should continue my journey. Yep, okay. All good. Let's get to fishing. <laughs> okay, so whenever it's nighttime... I guess the boat doesn't move at all. The night time's almost over. I can fish. God! That. I'm gonna go to bed. <laughs> I'm tired of waiting. Oh, wait, I can make the what you call it? I think the the sawmill now. There we go. Oh my god, it's humongous. Good thing I upgraded my ship. Oh my god. to sing to the vegetables. Oh wait, no, they're right. I didn't realize they were right the whole time. <laughs> Oopsie. I guess I don't have to sing. You know what I do have to do? Um, 
run an ad because everybody we are an hour into stream so it's time for me to run some ads you can avoid that ad by subscribing for 4.99 just five dollars skip your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long or you can link your amazon prime to twitch and hashtag sub for free with prime just kidding um it is september so all new tier ones are discounted so guys click subscribe see if you can take advantage of a discount or a prime sub today turn ups time to check the stock market Dude, the turnip, like, internal debacle within Animal Crossing was so dumb, in my opinion. You know, I play the game to escape the real world. I don't want to play stocks. It was so D.O.M. It's also because, like, I never had a good, I never had a good turnip day on my island. Like, the most I could get them to sell for was, like, I think a hundred. Yeah, do you use calculators? Yeah, that's why I'm like, I ain't doing that ish, you know? Why am I getting ads when I'm on Prime? That's weird. Um, try refresh your tab, because you should not be getting ads. Wait, I can actually check that. Hold. That should not be happening. Weird. I know, right? I know- wait, let me actually check that really quick. Because I know there's a setting within Twitch. Um, let's see. Twitch setting to make subs watch ads. Affiliate settings guide. Hmm. Okay, it's a 42 second video. I'm gonna watch it real quick. <laughs> okay, just tell me how to do it. Okay. Because I, I've, I assume I had it toggled off, so you should not be getting one. If you are, then that's Twitch doing the L. Let's see. Subscriptions. Wait, isn't that setting option isn't there anymore? What the fuck? Loyalty badges. Huh. So usually in your Twitch settings. You can- a, a streamer can toggle on ad-free viewing. Let's see, what year did this video come out? Oh, it came out 2021. Huh. Hmm. Because you should not be getting an ad. Oh, wait, yeah, I do have that toggle on. Allow subscribers to watch your content on the channel ad-free. Yeah, so I have that setting toggled on. So, um, just refresh. It should work next time, Chip. Hi, Mac. Welcome in. Hi, Mac. I refreshed? Okay, good. Because I know sometimes, like, with the Twitch Prime Prime, Twitch Prime subs, sometimes it doesn't work, which is stupid. Like, it should work. I know Mac has that issue sometimes with having ads, even though they're subscribed, so... I don't know, it's just a Twitch thing. You should, like, write a really mean, um, Google Play review. And then maybe they'll do something. Yeah, the Prime sub does take, like, 
a while to reset or refresh at the end of every month. But you know what? With every blessing comes its negatives, right? <laughs> I don't know why that got scared. <laughs> I was talking to my sister yesterday because she and I are planning on doing a Japan trip in 2026 because hopefully by 2026 I'll have like some type of savings built up or maybe I'll get a, a job or I'll get disability or maybe YouTube will give me money so she and I were talking we're like what if for the Japan trip we did a cruise and apparently there's like a cruise liner that goes that's two weeks long and it goes all around um, like, all the way around the ports in Japan. So she and I were like, that could be kind of fun. Because <laughs> if we do a cruise trip, then that's, like, basically all your hotels. Like, that's, like, one or two meals every day. That's, like, transportation. Obviously, we'd have to fly to Japan. But the cruise we were looking at was, like, it was, like, 2,000 to 2,500. So it's, like... When in comparison, if you were going from hotel to hotel for two weeks in Japan, it would cost, like, about 2000 So it's like, maybe we should try that. <laughs> I don't know. This is, like, years. In, like, two years or something. Cruises are so much fun. Yeah. I went on one when I was in, like, fourth grade because my grandma took um, my family on one. And it was to Alaska. So it was only, like, a few days because we were going from Washington to Canada and then Alaska. And it was pretty cool. Like, my favorite part was being on the boat and, like, being in the little daycare room. Because all the other kids are cool. But then I also think that going on a cruise is, like, the most basic-ass shit you can do. <laughs> anyway, back to the game. Stella, I've got to tell you. There was something I stumbled upon some time ago, and up until now it didn't seem that important. Brace yourself. Oh, yeah, there's jellyfish coming. Remember my parents' manor on the lake? As weird as it sounds, it's not too far from here. Mm. Yes, I know. It makes me wonder about this world, too. I must admit, I've been actively trying to avoid it. At any rate, it's become hard to ignore. As I've spent much time with you here, I think I'm ready to tackle this challenge. I'll probably only find regrets and sorrows there, but it's worth a shot. I've added the location to your map. I'll be ready whenever you are. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, great. Jellyfish are here again. Remember, you just have to crash into them to make the light burst. You won't get hurt, and I will feel quite queasy. Oh. I know they will be back, but at least it will buy me a bit more time. What do you say? Mm -hmm. Don't be scared, Stella. They'll be coming straight for us. Yeah, don't worry. I'll save everyone. Guys, if I made a sub goal that was <laughs> 1,000 subs and put cruise fund... <laughs> Would you guys support? Oh, bye, Mac! That would go crazy. <laughs> yeah, guys, we're, um, Subathon is for cruise fund. And then if we hit that sub goal, instead of streaming from the cruise, I would do, um, green screen cruise trip. God, I missed him. But bye, Mac. Drive safe. Oh, what am I doing? Oh, that was quick. Quick. <laughs> Would it be better than the green skin graduation? Are you saying 
that stream was bad? I thought it was hilarious. I'm writing this down. I have an idea and nobody can cop it. I'm not going to say it. And I don't think anybody would even guess it. Because it's kind of niche. Anyway, I wrote down my idea. And yes, it's related to the cruise stream. <laughs> a nice catch, Sprout. You just fished out a bottle from the sea. That's not trash. It could be anything in there. A tiny ship, old wine, a baby crab. Yes, yes, it could even be trash. Go ahead and crack it open. Didn't you just say the idea? No, I have it. I just had a different idea. Wow. This looks amazing. Iceberg? <laughs> what? Thank you for helping me out, Stella. This sawmill is so big. What a beauty. There's just one problem. Now don't get mad. I don't have any money to repay you. I guess that's why they call it a favor. You see what I did there? Thanks again, Sprout. <laughs> oh no. Oh. Stella, can you hear my stomach? It's restless. Do you have a little something for me? Yes, sir. I would prefer something else. I can still taste the flavor some last time. Oh, I'm skipping, sorry. Stella, dear, have you been doing good? I see you've been taking good care of your plants. But that's good. I hope my teachers are helping you in some way. You know, I used to be quite the little soldier. Midfield State University. Agronomical Engineering Class of 71. Top grades in a progressive profile. I was hired right away by one of the big corporations that put me in charge of a large parcel of land. Several thousands of acres. I was to maximize the output of our land assets. Well, that's what I did. And believe me, it did go well. I crammed the field full of transgenic seeds. When insects came, I doused them with poison. And when the soil turned gray, I pumped it full of chemicals. Great powerful stems grew upon these grounds, and plentiful, unnaturally enormous cobs. But underneath all laid on unfathomable sickness. <sighs> I guess it was inevitable that I met the dragon then, sooner or later. Did he do like a genocide? <laughs> oh, thank you, I was quite hungry. And that's a big one. Oh, wow. There's no way our boat is getting through that. Maybe I'll better something in his arsenal. Some dynamite or something. Oh, that's why on the map it had like a blue line. Icebergs. Seems like we're trapped. over here. There's so much to do on the ship now. I gotta water everything, I gotta mill, I gotta loom. Okay, 
I'm gonna see what I need to upgrade first. Or rather, build. The only thing I don't have is foundry, so I need coal and oak planks. Oak planks and limestone, so I need oak planks, oak planks. Oh, wow. <laughs> I got dust. You're doing it all wrong. Let me give you a hand. When you're cutting logs, you need to make sure your measurements are accurate. Then you cut. Measure twice and cut. You just need to keep your saw blade steady and on the cutting line. If you don't do it properly, you'll end up using, losing a pinky or an arm. Or something worse. And a hit from the old hammer for good luck. Give it a try now, you rascal. Damn, good thing I didn't use all my logs. Yeah, let's do one. Oh! Oh no. Okay, so I have to like move my directional stick up and down. Oh no. <laughs> it's so bad. Damn. Oh man, that that mini game I actually hate. It's so difficult. Hey, Sprout! A storm! Let's try and catch some lightning. Remember, your Everlight will protect you. What do you say? Yes, sir? That's the spirit. Just stand below each hit. It's too dark to navigate. Guess I'll go to bed. Maybe I'll- I need to end up buying oak logs.
Because I don't I haven't been on any islands that have oak trees. I think this has to be my favorite mini game. Even though I like, I hate anything that has to do with Fabric IRL. Like my mom and my grandma try to teach me crocheting, but I can't do it. I think it's because, like, in my head, I'm like, oh, this is an old person thing. I don't want to do it just yet. And I also think, like, crocheting in itself, you usually work off a of pattern, so there's, like, a limit to what you, or how much, like, original things you can do without having, like, a good idea of, like, how to work with tactiles. Villa Maggio. I think I'm gonna try a bit of fishing. It's been a while since I've done so. Nice, a bottle. Would you look at that? Oops. You did great. You're ready to start cutting wood like a champ. Just remember to be careful with this sawmill. Don't go and mess around with dangerous saw blades. Just because you've got leftover wood doesn't mean you should cut your hand off. Don't worry, Uncle. I won't do it. I'm very careful. <laughs> Unless... Hey, Sprout. You've been chopping it up in the sawmill. I like it. Getting the work done. Learn a new skill. Now that you've got some materials, maybe you could build me a house. Let me sketch something up real quick. Look, it's nothing fancy. It's pretty basic with just a few hinges here and a few nails in there. Oh. You've already got some materials to build something nice. I'm asking not only for me, but for the crew. Apparently I snore at night. Loudly, according to your friend Gwen. She doesn't sleep in the shared room anymore, though. She literally has her own manor. Villa Maggio discovered. Alright. Here we are. I'm. Cu it's curious. I'm both excited and anxious. I'm even starting to have second thoughts. As if... Never mind. Let's go. Ooh. Seems like there's drama here. Ooh. 
Bamboo Shortcut. Old painting and a linen seed. Oh. How long has it been since we've been here together, Stella? Seems Jerry has been taking good care of the premises. He's always been the best gardener we ever had with us. Mom has never been home much since Father died. Shit. I'm much more emotional than I thought I could ever be. I love this house so much. As much as I hated it, probably. Look, I don't think I can go in there. Even with you. It's just... No, I can't. Go without me, I'll wait for you here. Here's the key. Oh, and Stella? If you stumble upon my old music box, would you bring it back to me? Thanks a lot. Remember, this house has always been a real labyrinth. If you're lost, you have to follow the light. Good luck in there. I'll wait for you outside. Okay, there's about to be a key for the shed inside. I'm in. We got the loom upgrades and a music box. Oh. Welcome, small traveler, to my humble palace. Everything I own is the finest quality. Everything is also bolted down, so don't get any funny ideas. seen my splendid silverware collection? It's an old family heirloom. I've been told it was priceless, but I'll let you in on a little insider oh. secret. It's very pricey. Oh. Everything that the light touches is mine. And also everything the light doesn't touch. Yeah, everything's mine. Oh. This house is so big, people sometimes get lost walking through it. Wandering around for hours, even days. Growing ever hungrier. Glimpses of shadowy figures slipping in and out of every... Of the very edge of their vision. An endless daedalus of wealth and splendor. What? Me? Oh. No, of course. Never happened to me, since this is obviously my house. What a silly thing to say. Oh. Why do I never leave this balcony? You ask? Because it's my house, and I can do whatever I want in it. That's why I'm rich. You know who else will get rich one day? The followers. Because, guys, we are another 30 minutes into stream. So if you're anywhere, click follow. You get cool emotes and the ability to type in chat. Can we hit our daily goal? Smile. I wonder how many dialogue options this guy has. Or if he's just going to keep going on and on and on about his endless supply of money. Oh. Oh, he does loop. Okay. <laughs> Have you seen my splendid silverware collection? Oh. Ooh, can I go this way? No. I haven't been able to access the room on the left. Oh. 
I just jumped up here. Old carpet. Wow. I want to get to the roof. There's gotta be a way. There you go. Found the box. Could you give it to me? Mm. A little variety, please. Mm. This is outrageously good. Comfort food always tastes so good. Gotta be a, a way to get to the roof. I'm gonna go in one more time. Yeah, I can't stand on the rooftops. Okay, no matter what door you go in, the light always goes on. Maybe I can jump from here. Oh! Oh, wait! I can't jump high enough. Maybe I have to come back here. Because I think there's like a glide power up you unlock later. Damn. Hey, Stella. As you know, I tend to get hungry. That's just a fact of life. 
Sometimes when I do, I get hungry for really specific things. Your Aunt V would call it laser-focused tummy. Don't get me wrong. I still eat pretty much whatever you put in front of me. I just like for you to put some effort into this one. I'll give you a shot when I get a craving. Hopefully I won't ask for anything too extreme. You, ever, you never know with this appetite. Fair warning, Sprout. I think I'll see if I can build their houses now. Limestone, oak plank, and... Maple plank. Oh, okay, I can make planks. I can easily do that. Perfect. No matter what, you still get sawdust. That's kind of silly. But I guess you just get more logs if you do it, or more planks if you do well. Okay, I'm so bad. <laughs> Welcome back. I made it to your mom's house? No! There we go. Good as it's gonna get. He does not need this much space. I think he's being greedy. I need oak. Cut. 
I'm gonna go to bed till morning. Then we can set sail. anything new so my plan for now is just gonna be exploring so I want to like go along the whole border of the icebergs just to see what's out there and while we explore we can fish Just like true sailors do. <laughs> uh, okay. As my- As I was talking about the cruise with my sister <laughs> last night, she was like, What happens if like the boat sinks? We can't swim. And then I was like, It'd be just like a plane crashing. You would just have to say GG's and that's it. You know, the likelihood of a cruise sinking, I think also very low. I do genuinely think like the only perk about being a woman is that a lot of people still have the woman and children first mentality so you I would get my ass saved that's the only good part you both can't swim yes we cannot swim so please do not push me in the pool for a prank I would die no I wouldn't I, I know how to float <laughs> if you survive that that'd be the craziest Mario Kart story time Dude, I can farm so many clips. Be like, I survived a ship sinking, not clickbait in all caps. <laughs> My dad threw me in and that's how I learned. I can't remember. I think it's because... My mom doesn't know how to swim. She used to, but she just doesn't know how anymore. My dad used to work... He used to be in the Navy. Oh. So he knew, he knows how to swim. So if we drown, he'll be able to save us. <laughs> I went on a cruise gone wrong, gone sexual. <laughs> it's perfect, Sprout. It's massive. All this room for little one me. I can't wait to catch some shut eye. This is really great. Thank you so much. I won't forget this. Dude, I keep on giving him a different voice every time. I'm sorry. I just can't do it. I forgot how I did it. Hey, Stella. Oh, I think that was it. You know me. I can always go for a little snack. Something salty. Something buttery. Something with flavor. Oh, jeez. You know what would be just perfect? A big old bag of popcorn all to myself. Sure. Just go ahead and heat up some corn. I actually have some popcorn right here, boss. My last one. Hmm. That really did fill me up. However, it did make me miss my kids a whole lot. I used to make babs of pop babs. I used to make bags of popcorn on movie night for them. Even with the TV turned up, you couldn't hear the actors talking. The crunching was so loud. It was, it was the only way to calm those little monsters down. Watching those terrible kids movies. Aww. I wish I was still there. To see them laughing. For them to fall asleep on me. Thank you for this popcorn. I was looking at your kitchen yesterday. It's fine. Nothing special. It reminds me of my first kitchen. 
in my terrible apartment. I didn't know what I was doing in there. I was so careless with the spices. Not enough salt. Anyways, here's a little something to brighten this mess up. Don't worry, it's not a spice rack. You need to actually work for it, but it will be worth it. Just improve your kitchen with some extra oven space. Your kitchen will be looking just right in no time. Ooh, a kitchen upgrade. <laughs> Sinking ship in the them now. Red circle with an arrow. <laughs> I survived. <laughs> Dude, I can't. Imagine. Okay, hypothetically, if your ship does sink, I think it's better to just float than swim, because when you swim, you waste your energy. Like, you should only really swim if you're in immediate danger or if there's, like, sharks. I'm still exploring. Oh, you can build multiple of each building. Still need oak. <laughs> Still uncorked? You really need to open up that bottle, Sprouts. I'm sure you won't be disappointed. Oh, yeah. Sorry, boss. How do I do that? Actually, how do I how do I do that? Oh, thank you. I was quite hungry. How do <laughs> Uncle, how do I open the bottle? some work done on it. I'm always ready for some DIY action. I just hope the others appreciate it. Uncle, tell me. Sure. Wasn't that great, favorite niece of mine? Missions. Hmm. 
I'm gonna look at the game manual. Quest log. Oh, it's minus. Classic. Okay, give Gwen the music box. Upgrade, upgrade. Okay. Atul really wants you to open a bottle from the sea. Message from far away. I should open it. How do I open it? How do I open it? Boss. Interact. Okay, press A to interact. Falling off the boat. Diving treasure. Sleep. Waking up. Safe travel mode. I'm clueless. Oh, this is pretty. The green. A tool? More like a tool. You won't tell me how to open it. Look it up in a bit. I'll look it up. It's annoying me. <laughs> Let's see. Spirit Fair Open Bottle. Okay, bring up your inventory. How do I open the inventory? <sighs> okay, spare fair how to open inventory. <laughs> By default, it's our trigger. What? Oh, wait. X is inventory. It literally says it in the files. Oh, my God. <laughs> you got the brochure for Borogawa Tours. Greetings from... Experience the wonders of the great oak forest and the serenity of the magnificent rice fields. Available now in Guru Fields. Oh, okay. I didn't realize I had to open these. Message in a bottle. Oh, to an axe. A lumberjack without an axe. Crying and sobbing. Old trees aren't feeling the cutting. We'll grow old, they said, laughing. That was from the other island from earlier today. Okay, I think I got it. I got it. I wonder how I unlock more recipes. Oh, probably when I upgrade the kitchen. Duh. You 
got a fish. Now we wait. Man, it takes so damn long. I have been craving, like, fish and chips, though. I don't think there's any near me. Because, like, the only, like, fish and chips place we have here in Washington is, like, Ivers. Otherwise, you gotta be near, like, the ports if you want, like, decent fish and chips. But the Ivers in my town, like, closed down. Like, two years ago. So there's no good place that has, like, even bad seafood. <laughs> Finally. Jeez. Ooh, grilled fish. Ooh. This is taking a long time. But you know what doesn't take a long time? Um, subscribing. Because guys, we are another hour in a stream, so it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing for $4.99, just $5. And it's also September, so new tier ones are discounted up to 25% off. So it might be less than $5 for you. You can also link your Amazon Prime to Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe, see if you have a Prime sub or discounts available. Get some water, get a snack. We'll see some of you guys in a few. And look, it's still, it's still cooking. Let them cook. Do I have let them cook enabled? I don't. <gasps> I'll enable it for the fans. It's still cooking. October's coming up, so we're gonna get to use the October emote soon. And we're still waiting. Almost there? Finally. Ooh, squid skewer. I think I'm done cooking. Somebody is like snoring really loud in game. Oh wow. Old shoe, empty bottle, valuable ring, empty shell. These are the odd seeds that I bought. Empty bottle, valuable ring, empty shell. Okay, that's not too bad, but I don't think I'd buy it again. It seems like a bunch of random junk. So I think I'm just gonna do chores whenever it's nighttime.
I only have ten. Damn. I guess I'll go to bed then. We weren't even moving. <laughs> Oopsie. <laughs> we were taking a little break. My sea legs were getting a little wobbly. Discovered. Oh, I can double jump out of water. Expected to have double jumps in games, but in reality, it's like near impossible. Oh, a visitor! Welcome! Are you here for our world renowned Furugawa Tours? Of course you are, you're holding our brochure. The tour is about to start. It takes about five minutes and covers the history and flora of this island. After, you'll be able to tell all your friends about it. Don't worry. There's no gift shop after this tour. Ready? Yeah. Perfect. Let's start right away. As you can see, this island doesn't get many visitors. People tend to focus on big city attractions. Here, it's peaceful and quiet. That's something you'll notice with the fauna. Rice patches and healthy forest are its main attraction. Moving on. Over here, the rice production here is quite incredible. Workers harvest around the clock to feed local families. Right now, no one is around. I'm not sure why. I sometimes play with them when I am off duty. But that's besides the point. Off to our next stop. Don't get too close. And six feet. Social distancing. We love. Oh, these are pretty. Alright. You can feel the humidity. I mean, really feel it. This oak forest really gets to me. We have a connection. A strange connection. I tend to skip this part of the tour, to be honest. If I could move along, that would be great. I won't chop it down. That, that'd be rude. That'd be very rude of me. Speaking of which, this fortune tree is the centerpiece of this whole island. We're not sure when it was first planted. People from all around would travel here and leave little messages. Anything to help with their lives. Alright, this concludes our tour. Furubagawa Tours is grateful for your participation. Thank you for your ears and your patience. Thank you again for your presence. If you'd like to leave a tip, that would be appreciated. I recommend something along the lines of 50 glims? Why not? I'm rich. That's amazing. I sure, I knew I struck a chord with you. I'll sign you up to our upcoming tours newsletter. You'll have an educational great time. Thank you for your kind spirit. 
Oh, they're gone. Wow, berries. These look incredible. I was just dreaming about these. Delicious. I'd hankering for this. Ooh, strawberries. Citrine. This game is so cute. I know. I guess we'll have to come back. Yeah, I don't think I can jump up here. Sad day. You know what I must do. I need oak so I can build Sunny a home. Finally. I love finding new emotes in 7TV. Yeah, I think I, I just enabled that one during the ad break. But some good chats to find good emotes is Squeakses. They always have a good handful. Thank you for taking the tour. Don't forget to tell your friends. Don't worry, I will. And I'll be coming back to get more wood. Where to next, balls? Oh, I can only have two waypoints. Okay. Or three waypoints. Hey! Did you forget about that kitchen? It really needs to be improved. Shut up! Oh my god. Does he not see that I have better things to do? Oh wait. Onion Man was back here. Shit. Guess we missed the Onion Man. He scammed us anyway. Lots 
to diving. I like how chatty a tool is. The other NPCs, or I mean friends, are kind of boring. I was hungry as usual, so I did something about it. I went outside the boat and gathered some berries, but I went a little overboard. I have too much. Here you go. Have a wonderful day. Thank you, Uncle. Okay, I missed the onion man, and now the icon is gonna keep showing up. We're gonna ignore it. Oh, it didn't matter anyway, it would have stopped because it's nighttime. Nothing lost. my favorite time in the game because you can't even see the horizon line it looks like a simple gradient but it's meant to imply the haze and it's really nice so what is the point of this game um i'm technically like the grim reaper so i have to get all my friends ready for death and it's actually like kind of sad Somebody on the bus stop. Yeah, we're gonna go back. I should um how do I I wanna cancel there we go and I go back to the bus stop
a traveler. Welcome to one of my famous bus stops. I found them. They're mine. All mine. My name is Alex. It's a beautiful name. The best name. But don't call me Alexander. Blah. It's a garbage name. A garbage name for garbage people. Where was I? Oh, yes. I'm Alex, and I'll be your bus driver. I wasn't always a bus driver. Before, I was an accountant. Numbers were my shame. In taking you places is my game. Choo-choo. No, wait, that's a train. This is a bus stop, and I'm your driver. Want to go somewhere? Music? You... You don't like my music? Really? You really want me to stop my wonderful music? No, it's fine. Do you? Does that mean? <laughs> it was but a prank. Good one. Oh, so you can only take the bus stop. Oh, shoot. During daytime. My name is Alex, and I'm your bus driver. Where you want to go? Okay, so I guess you do the bus if you don't have the boat, but we're on the boat, so what's the point? Alexander's your brother's name, Manny. This guy hates him. Alex hates Alexander. Classic. You can never have the same name. It's just not allowed. You should know this. There was one class in, like, middle school, I think, where there was two other people who had the same name as me, but they were both spelled differently. And it was annoying. I do like his music, though. It sounds like something he made himself. So of course we have to be nice to him about it. Ooh, a fancy vase. Holy. After this one, I'm gonna go to bed, because it seems like the nighttime hours is fairly long in game. Easy. Also, I don't get why we can't sail at night. You know, the pros do it, why can't I? Can't see at night? I have night vision. Oh, two more oak planks and two more limestone. Collar worker. I've been wasting all the product. Ooh. Iwashima countryside discovered. I 
I've noticed ever since... What's her name? She got... <laughs> she has a mask on. <laughs> ever since she got her own house, she's just been staying in her house. She's become more of a recluse. Okay, I gotta mute real quick. Yo, is my sister. <laughs> Mute streamer, yeah. You guys gotta read my lips. Even though my lips, like, don't even move much. She can't see the chat. She's, like, over there. She's across the room. That would be impossible. Yeah, okay, 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 guys, guys, guys. Little challenge. Try to see what I'm saying. Ready? If you guess it, you get a million dollars. Any guessers? <laughs> Can anybody guess what I say? Or what I said? Any guessers? You guys have until the end of stream today. Unless? No, I did not say- I said a phrase. I said a question. <laughs> what if I said boopy? <laughs> I did not say boopy. No, but, like, I seriously should become a ventriloquist. Because, like, I, I can talk- wait. I can, like, talk out of the side of my mouth. Sometimes I practice. It looks like you said one word. Wait, let's see. I said four words. Lip readers in shambles. What I love about spinning is the talent you need, you know? It takes real skill to find a target, aim, and hit a bullseye. Mm. That's skill and raw talent right there. I just love that I'm good at something. Okay, weird. Mm -hmm. I could spit off tall buildings forever. On the off chance that it might hit someone right in the head, I seem to never run out of spit. Mm. This small bridge isn't very high up, and nobody ever swims down there. Still, it's pretty satisfying to spit. I'm fully equipped. I've got my mouth. I've got my bottle of water. I'm ready and I've got the spirit to do it for years. They're weird. I don't like spit. Especially after the... What's his name? The doc that just came out against the very bad guy. Russell Brand? Was that it? I saw clips of it. I didn't want to watch the whole thing because I would be triggered. Anyway, guys. Consent is great. Always ask your partner. Before you get to know them better, obviously there's verbal and then non-verbal communication. But if it's with a new partner, always communicate before you do anything. Any touches. Any new touches. 
Because just because you like something doesn't mean you should expect your partner to like it as well. And it doesn't matter if you're like married to somebody or if you're in a long-term committed relationship, you're not entitled to, to them in any meaning of the word. Anyway, that's your life lesson number 36. You can also learn more life lessons by following the channel, guys. We are another 30 minutes in the stream, so when you are follow, you get cool emotes and the ability to type in chat. Smile. Oh, that's it. I love how Tool gets freaked out over berries every single time. Oh! Secret? Yeah, why can't I just fly? I still have to give Gwen- I'll do that first. Give Gwen the music box. I keep forgetting. Oh, hey, it's this guy. Oh. Over here. If you ever have any clutter, I'm always interested. Maybe we could even trade. You give me your useless items, and I'll give you mine. Just the thought of the new curios makes my head spin. It neatly organized my stock and errands. Take a look at yourself. Grilled vegetable poached fruit. Find and collect sockeye sin. Okay, okay, I think I can do the... The poached fruit. So I think I have fruit, so it's probably just regular or any fruit in the oven. I do wish I could cook multiple things at once. Or not like not multiple the same thing but different types of things at once. It takes so long. So, um what did you guys do yesterday? Can we do a callback? Oh, uh, for context. During the Mario Kart stream we did on Tuesday. I think it was Tuesday. It was Tuesday or Monday. Um, I was like, guys, let's do an experiment. Everybody tell me what you did yesterday, and I'm gonna reply to everybody. And it was mainly reinforcing the point that the creator should not acknowledge every single chat message. Because it can get kind of overwhelming, and then you can't give, like, proper time to explain or do tangents. Because if you're going from topic to topic too quickly, it makes- for me, it ruins, like, the tone and overall, like, ability for me to express myself. Poached fruit, easy. Ooh, I bet when I upgrade the kitchen, I can cook multiple things. Hmm. Your mom? That's not very nice. And you said you're going to her house today. That's two days in a row. My dad's gonna find out. <laughs> what did I do yesterday? I went to the doctor. 
And they were like, you should seriously consider brain surgeon. And I was like, smile. So I have to go talk to another doctor soon. And then I went to the store. I got some food. I got McDonald's. And the McDonald's was really fucking good. <laughs> Because I went at like 1 p.m. So like it was just after the lunch rush ended. So it was like fresh fries, fresh burgers. Oh my god, it was so good. And then I went to Hobby Lobby. And then I hung out with my sister. And then she and I played Mario Kart. And I beat her. Man, $2,000? That's so much money. How does this guy have so much money? I don't want an odd seed. Okay, he sells shit. I don't want shit. Oil on canvas. Half legible signature with a skill display of Chiaroscuro and Spumato. Should be sold. Anything that says should be sold, I will sell. Damn, I'm rich. Oh, the old carpet was for a thousand dollars, not a hundred dollars. He wasn't scamming me. A wonderful item. It should be pronounced vase, not vase. Should be sold. Yeah, if I need to buy minerals, I probably have to go to the town. Yeah, I'm up 12k. Let's see what he's gonna resell my junk for. 1300, 820! Damn, he's out here scamming. But you know, I'm still up 7k. It's whatever. Well done! You completed your first errand. What a great haul. There's plenty more to do if you ever feel like it. I'll always be around. Oh, it's, it's still daytime. Also, guys, don't worry about the surgery thing. It's not like I'm gonna die. It, it's just like, if I do choose to get like the, the brain surgery, then it's gonna like, possibly, like 85% chance to relieve any pain that I experience. So it's not like it's a necessary procedure. I hope it does. That would be cool. But, like, the, the only thing I'm, like, kind of concerned about is, like, insurance won't necessarily cover everything, is my assumption. Because um, I'm on the brokey state insurance, because I'm poor. And disabled, technically. So, it could be an issue of, like, maybe it'll cover the actual procedure, but it won't cover, like, the hospice care. Because the procedure that I'm going to have to get, like, it's a brain surgery, so, like, obviously I can't leave the hospital right away. I, I would have to be monitored. So they said I would probably have to do, like, three to four days hospice. So it's, like, even a night in a hospital can be, like, thousands of dollars. So it's, like, if that is not covered, then that's not going to be an option. So... I don't know. I, we just gotta wait until the YouTube money kicks in. Then it'll be a for sure.
I've seen like so many... I was gonna say sob stories, but that's not the right name for it. Like so many people like obviously go through hardships, like have to be hospitalized. But like emergency situations. And then you get like a bill like a week or a month later, but like, oh, the ambulance cost you like $500. The, the little shot you got cost you 500 And it's like... I don't understand why healthcare isn't offered in our country. It, it is kind of silly that you have, you have to pay to, like, live sometimes. Or you have to... Like, your family has to make the decision if... They'll be willing to pay to keep you healthy. Or alive sometimes. And it's very sad. Like, you would think that America being, like, the world power and theoretically the richest country should be able to provide for its people more. And that's why we love socialism, guys. How are you prepping people? Oh, for death? <laughs> um, I basically take them on my boat. They spill all their drama and tea. And then I make them food. And then, um, they die. Dude, my cat just died. But we, we haven't had to send anybody to the afterlife yet. Because I, my prediction for this game is the person has to be like willing, be like, oh, I'm ready now. Because it seems like everybody has like unfinished business here, on in this little shadow realm. Like they have trauma that they need to face. So you know they gotta be ready to die. I think it's funny how some, like, <laughs> some crewmates will just stay in bed whenever they hear a thump, but oh, Atul always comes out. He's like, what's that? He's chipper about everything. I still need to give what's her name her music box. I will do that after I water this plant. Oopsie. Wake up. Oh, I need to ring the bell. No wonder everybody's been staying in their cabins. I don't wake them up. I'm sorry. Thank you. I'll hold on to it. Oh, you found something else? Wow, I forgot I even had that. It's an old manual for a golden royale. 
Remember that they had won his first prize in the town's yearly tombola? I dreamt of having this machine since second grade, but father would never let me participate in the lottery. This manual will come in handy. We can use it as an upgrade for your loom. I... Yeah, l let's get back to the boat. And forget this place ever existed. Oh, I was supposed to give her the music box when we were at her manor. <laughs> That's why she's like, get back on the boat. Okay, Mount Toroyama discovered. Okay. Okay, I need to add the ice bracer breaker to the boat, improve the kitchen, and build Summer's Sanctuary. I think I can build Summer's... No, I need more limestone. Sprout. Why don't you fish anymore? It's really calming. You just cast the line and you wait. So relaxing, then it's the fight of your life. You give it all your heart. What's not to love about it? Just because I don't want to do what you want to do, Uncle, doesn't mean I don't like you. That's how my parents think? Uh-oh. I mean, my parents didn't go to college, but they told me to go to college, so... I don't know. Our parents were like, just do whatever you guys want. Just, like, don't hurt yourselves. Or don't do, like, stupid shit. And that's what we did. Or didn't do. <laughs> We did not do stupid shit. New friend? Oh! Hello there, young lady! How are you doing? Oh, yes! Right! Perhaps you can help me! You must have stumbled upon a fluffy sheep on the loose down there. I tried getting it back in its enclosure, but the stubborn creature wouldn't listen to me. Chances on your side, its weak spot in is its gluttony. Still, so it would definitely follow anyone who would feed it. Would you be a deer and give it a try? Oh, it's locked. <laughs> follow me. How great! It's following you! Now just lead it to the enclosure next to the pier. Or follow me. I'm going there. Goodness! Oh, what a nice sheep! It followed you all the way to its home. Always following your stomach, aren't you, little guy? <laughs> Tee hee! My sons were just like that. Don't you think it looks lonely? Maybe that's why I left. I'm gonna keep it company, don't worry. But maybe. Well, if you found another stray sheep, could you bring it back here? They could entertain each other. Well, if it's not too inconvenient for you. Oh, I'm Alice, by the way. Very nice meeting you. Have you found another sheep? I'm happy to keep you company, but another sheep would probably be better company than a silly old lady. Don't you think? <laughs> okay, we gotta get another sheep. In the mines we go.
Ooh, secret. I don't think there has been a thing that I don't like visually in this game. The 2D style implemented with the 3D models, the environments, it's all very nice. There's gotta be a sheep in here. There we go, finally. <laughs> Left or right? Ooh. Right is right. timing goo and I don't have it oh my god here we go jeez came in though yeah there's no marking on the top of the gate now well this is a different area <laughs> me waiting for your mom do I like ketchup strips? I have yet to try them. But I know there's a thing in Canada. I think I know how to get another the sheep. Because in some of the upgrades, it said that you can have, like, livestock on your boat. So you probably just need to unlock livestock and then come back here. Once I can have sheep on my boat. Yeah. She's not going to come on my boat until I get more sheep. I wonder if I get a sheep from another island. And I could just bring it back on my boat. Hmm. Peace, I too. Hmm. Hey, Stella. Stella, I. No, never mind. Nostalgia is not my forte. I'm slightly happy the villa is still in good condition. Or is it? Okay, let's change the subject. 
You must have noticed the improved tab on your blueprint table. Through there, you can add decorative elements to the spirit houses and their stations. Oh. It's time to upgrade this loom of yours. Once you've got the required resources, go for it. It's the only way to craft fabric from thread. Oh. Go on. I need maple planks. Okay, I can make that right now, actually. Linen... Okay, so I need to upgrade the loom first, and then I can upgrade the kitchen. That's why. So... I was supposed to give her the music box, but then I never did. Maple planks. Maple planks. It looks exactly the same. Brilliant. Now the loom is fully useful. Of course, many stations can be upgraded. You just have to find the blueprints for them and the materials, of course. Stella? I believe it's time for me to teach you advanced loom techniques. Guess it's a thing. Mm -hmm. There are a few improvements you can make to the machine itself. It depends on how you place your hands on the machine. How you arrange threads as you load it has a big impact too. With a few simple tricks, you'll be able to craft much more intricate items. Fabric, actually. Here, let's go take a look. You can finally craft fabric from thread. Okay, I'm gonna wait till it's morning. That way she can show me how to do it properly. I don't want to waste material. You know whose time I'm not gonna waste? Um, these subscribers. Because guys, we are three hours in the stream, so it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing for $4.99. Just kidding, it's September. So all new tier 1s are discounted up to 25% off. Wow. Also, if you're new here, click the follow button. You get cool emotes and the ability to type in chat. After the ad, we're going to learn how to upgrade the loom. So if you don't want to miss a single second, subscribe. And then I think I'm gonna wrap it up after we do finish the loom tutorial because I gotta help my sister with some stuff. Smile. Okay, yes. That's new. Everybody wake up!
escape. Mm. Quick. There isn't really a fire, but I wouldn't mind a nice hot dish to warm me up. Oh, I got that right for you. I got some squeeze. Mm. Huh. This is absolutely exquisite. Worthy of the best fine dining restaurants I've been to. And I've been in those a lot. Thanks a lot. You're a natural. Why am I not surprised? You've reached a pro level now. There is nothing more I can teach you on this subject. That being said, and if you don't mind, I'll give it a go myself. It will definitely help me unwind a bit. I don't think I want to upgrade the homes. Yeah, you just it just gives them furniture. Oh, it just costs money. And oh, and materials for certain things. Okay, I don't think I want to upgrade or get decorations for the houses. I just want to upgrade the actual buildings. Okay, so I need 12 fabric? Oh my god. It's gonna take forever. Okay, I think the next place I want to go is to the shop that we can buy things. We'll buy things and then we'll wrap it up. Oh, we are so far away. Oh, wow. We got a long ways to go. Where am I? <laughs> oh, I'm here. Okay, let's make our way back to the shop. Because I need to buy a boatload more linen seeds. Oh, I guess I could build... I can build two gardens. Yeah, you can build multiple fields and gardens. I think I'll save up logs for that. Yeah, I need maple logs. Ooh, I can build Sunny Sanctuary now. Oh my god, it's humongous. Okay, I think I will move her home higher. Perfecto! Now we're good. How wonderful! Incredible, Stella! Wood! Plants! There's even an all-natural room for meditation! 
You really outdid yourself. Oh, well, I'll sleep in that hanging bed. Yes, I'll be back to full health in no time at all. And maybe... Listen. I have a favor to ask you. It's become quite obvious to me that I need to take better care of myself. Let the body listen to the mind. To that end, I need clarity. I need power and energy. Positive minerals are what I'm missing right now. Stones and crystals are connected to the world on an elementary level. Just as the moon is dark when hidden from the sun. Living beings wither when their terrific link is severed. So Stella, what do you say? Could you bring me some gems and minerals to fill in my cabinet? Three of them should be enough. And it won't be for nothing, you'll see. I can teach you about all the interesting properties of each one you bring to me. A new request. Give Summer three gemstones. I think I have those already. I'm gonna do a dive first, and then we'll give him the gemstones. I also need to remember to visit islands, because I need more wood, too. Because I don't know how often the, the trees respawn. Oh. Stella, can you hear my stomach? It's restless. Do you have a little something for me? Oh, thank you. I was quite hungry. piece of citrine? Did you know that citrine prompted motivation and activated creativity? I've also heard that it encourages self-expression and enhances concentration. A true mind revitalizer and emotion balancing stone. Okay, amethyst, diamond, opal. I might have amethyst and opal. Amethyst, diamond, opal. Amethyst, diamond, opal. Amethyst, diamond, opal. I was thinking... When the dragon found me back home, I knew I had to leave. I felt I wouldn't heal unless I left. I didn't know it then, but I needed love. And no love was to be found in this accursed place. But in my exile, I... I met your aunt. I have never seen anyone as joyful as Rose. Filled to the brim with uncontainable life. You remind me a lot of her, Stella. She nursed me back to health, little by little. Without her, well, the dragon would have taken me. Right there, I'm sure of it. And I never would have met you. She taught me. Not as one normally teaches, but by opening my eyes to what was already within. To the rich interior life unquashed by the dragon. Unquashed by my father. 
to the interconnectedness of all things, to the universal love. This immense debt I owe her. Well, maybe that's why I feel the need to teach you. Seems like he has daddy issues. Oh, an opal! A burning stone of passion and love. The stone of seduction, which resonates with burning desires and releases inhibition, but stabilizes emotions as well. Another context also. Another aunt. <laughs> In other contexts, opal also brings about loyalty and faithfulness. Dang, I don't got more gems. There's like so many tests that I have to do now. I'm liking where this is going. Because this seems like a game that you could just passively play. But it's keeping me fully entertained the whole time. And the resource management and managing the ship isn't too overwhelming. I'm liking it. This was going to be a game I was considering to play on my own. But I'm glad I'm, I chose it for stream. Because I, I like doing story stuff for stream. I feel like it, it leads to more discussions usually. Because I do feel like they give a lot more insight into like my character, I guess. And morale. And also doing voices is fun. Even if I'm not, like, consistent with it. Forgot what was here at the harbor. I think this is where I unlocked the double jump. Oh, I have not been here. Hello. Oh, oh welcome, welcome. We are the Hummingbird Hummingbird Preservation Society, which was established by well. Me? Oh. I was tired of sitting around and not doing anything. 
My name is John Marie Simons, and I believe in cleanliness. I believe in a clean hummingbird. Oh. That's why I and other volunteers are here. We want to restore this harbor. It is badly in need of a paint job. Oh. Bring back that sparkle. There used to be an old boat docked there. We could have used the materials to rebuild oh. these homes. Someone has apparently stolen it. People do silly things sometimes. If you'd like to give us a hand, we are always looking for volunteers. Oh. Right now, I think we just want to get these crates out of the water. Up for it? Of course you are. You're a go-getter. Hmm. This place is so dirty. I can't believe it. Good job. That was great. We'll keep painting and cleaning these stains. Probably get rid of that oh. dumpster. I heard what I think was a possum in there. Sometimes that's the way it goes. That's what happens day in and day out oh. over here. Repair, restore, and repeat. That's our motto. The three R's of Hummingbird Preservation Society. Oh. Hopefully no one is already using that motto. Well, back to business, but here is a small but crucial shopping list. If we get all of that, we'll be able to get this beaut the shine she deserves. Oh. Thanks again for your precious help. Be seeing you. Oh. I just believe in Hummingbird Preservation Society's mission so much. Oh, well, sh shenanigans and side missions. Household glue, silk threads, and oak planks. I don't have any of that. Sorry, man. Okay, let's get back to the shop. Good thing I checked here. I thought I've already been to this island.
I zoned out. <laughs> Dear lady, did you just stop smoking? I look at her, she's smoking literally all the time. It's like the little teenagers hitting their vapes. They need to tone it down. Peace I to vape? That emote will never happen because I'm never going to vape. I will never succumb to the temptation. Oh, Stella, my stomach is rumbling. Would you have anything to nibble on? Oh, thank you. I was quite hungry. I should make more food. We wait and we wait for the muscles to bake wait bake oh that's such a close rhyme when was the last time i even had muscles i don't think i've ever had like i've seen people eat it I do think I like it. I, I like most seafood. I just don't like stuff that's chewy. The food? Yeah. Oh, like, you mean muscles like guns? I don't like biting. So no, I haven't tried human muscles. And I'm also not a vampire. Why are these taking so gosh darn long? I just want some muscles. Oh wait, I can leave the room and come back. That's how ovens work. I'm <laughs> like, I thought I had to watch it. <laughs> so silly. Damn, it still wasn't done. Finally. Deemed self sh <laughs> shellfish. Sally sells seashells by the seashore. <laughs> Dude, I used to be so good at that tongue twister. But now I have a lisp.
can never really do tongue twisters. I can do them, it's just whenever you would like incrementally do get faster, I can never do. Too much for my little brain to handle. Take it back, I think this is my favorite time of day. The magenta clouds, holy moly. we can go shopping. The water really said peace sign to evil smile. Cause it's red? Huh? <laughs> so silly. Okay, scratch that. This is actually the prettiest time of the day. I got too greedy. That could have been the one. I think on this island we should be able to get some wood. Which I desperately need. I've been single for years now. <laughs> Finally some wood. Oh, I can't do it fast. Somebody got an auto-modded. Well, Mal, shut up. Am I not allowed to make jokes, Mac? This is my stream. You can even spell Lamau right. <laughs> Finally, some wood.
My cat just fell. <laughs> Stupid cat. You know what is not stupid? Following the channel. Because everybody, we are another 30 minutes in the stream. So if you're new here, follow. You get cool emotes and you get to type in chat, guys. It'd be very smart if you follow. Like, seriously. Final pitch stop of the day to Hummingbug. Not Hummingbird, Hummingbug. With a J. I just remembered some of the people on the boat will do chores for you. So I need to remember to wake people up right in the morning. That way they can get to work. Are there monkeys in this game? Probably. I don't know anything Laurel wise, but there's gotta be a monkey. Stella? I've been thinking about father recently. When he left with Doug, I didn't feel anything. No sorrow. No hate. No relief. Nothing. It didn't really matter to me. But it mattered to you. You spent three nights crying in Aunt Petunia's room. I bought you three sisters and gave you that damn oversized sweater I had knitted a month prior. Mum was appalled, but you felt better. I long wondered why you were so sad. And the best I could come up with is that you were sad in my stead. Feeling things I couldn't feel myself. Lore? Who's Doug? Did her dad get a boy toy? Hey, did you forget about that kitchen? It really needs to be improved. Shut up, oh my god. Good morning, honeybee. How about a little snack? I'm feeling quite hungry. Oh no, 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 no. Stella, don't you remember? I don't eat any animal product. I'm not saying that. Certainly that was not meant for our consumption. And the meat? No, no. I'm sorry. I won't impose my choices on others, but I cannot eat that. Okay, then don't eat it. Don't eat it, then. Oh, thank you. I was quite hungry. Time to do some shopping, and then we can go home. And by home, I mean end straight. Because I am hungry. I made beef this morning, and I want to eat my lunch. Were these flowers here last time? Can't remember. I'm buying all of them. I'm spamming out of my mind. I don't really need the other vegetables. Limestone, copper. Ooh. I don't really need... I'll buy like a few of these. I 
buy a handful of limestone. I think I'm good. <laughs> okay, so I guess I shouldn't really sell stuff to the squirrel. I will sell to the onion man. Oh, there's a secret in that room. I want it. Wait, no. Key to Hummingbird. The key opens the door now. Oh, yeah, I'll buy the key. I'm broke. After this, I was gonna go upgrade my boat, but now I have no money. Guys, can we get some subs? <laughs> I'm broke. Ceramic figurine. Ceramic figurine, a very delicate figurine. It's gotta be a main mission thing later on. Well, I have it and now I'm broke. Hmm. I should have waited on that. Now I can't upgrade my boat. God damn it. Well, it's time to go back in the boat. Time to go home. I think I just need to fish more, that way I can get more trinkets to sell. Oh shit, I left something in the oven! Oh no! Um... Imagine- oh no, it's on fire! Oh no! Oh no! Ooh, shrimp cocktail! Very nice! Imagine I come back and the boat is just ashes! Oh my god. I think we should end it here. Guys, that was fun. I think I know what I'm doing in the game. I just have to explore more. Actually open my items if I catch stuff. And work on upgrading. Now I have a game plan. So, very nice. I really enjoy this game so far. I like it a lot. Uh, this is going to be our continuous story game until we beat it. I will not abandon this game. So guys... We're wrapping it up here, so if we want to do calligraphy, you can use your channel points, or you can sub with Prime, and we'll do calligraphy. Light blue, like the sky. Okay, I can do that. Let me get that camera and some music on for you guys. While I'm getting the camera set up, gentle reminder, if you are a real Peace in 17 fan, make sure you are following my offline social media. I have a Twitter, Instagram, and a TikTok. Go follow all three. And I have daily YouTube shorts and weekly stream highlights on my YouTube channels. YouTube.com slash at Peace in 17 or at Peace in 17 clips. Guys, click subscribe right now or click the link and then subscribe to the channels. Okay, let's get some music on. Still Mori. I love Mori. I've been debating if I want to replay it Omori or not, like in my own time. I've been really wanting to.
Mainly because since I did the, um... The true ending for Amoria, I kind of wanted to do the bad ending where I just stay in Dream World the whole time. It was fire? Yeah, I, I, I want to play it again. This is our last name of the day. If you want me to write your name, all I gotta do is use your channel points. Pastel pink, Hello Kitty, and real aesthetic. Okay. this is the closest I have because a lot of the pinks that came in this tone bow kit are like um, fleshy tone pinks there are a lot of light pinks It's more light in person. It looks more magenta, but I promise it's like more light. But last call, everybody, last call. Y'all got five seconds. If you want your name written, last call. Also, before anybody asks, this is a bug bite. I went to a little trail this weekend and I got a boatload of bug bites. It's not a hickey. And if it was a hickey, it'd be from your mom. All of your mom. <laughs> Bees like to hickey? No, guys. The strap with hickeys. You guys know this. You put hickeys where people can't see it. I was gonna ask. Oh my god. Yeah, it's a bug bite. It's almost gone. I was gonna ask. Oh my god, imagine. Dude, that would have been so awkward. Imagine. No, because back when I was smashing somebody, I explicitly told them, I was like, please do not leave marks where people can see them, because I don't know how to use makeup. I wouldn't, I wouldn't know to, I wouldn't know how to, like, cover it up. I have a massive pimple on my nose, dude. The mark is still here. From like a month ago, because they kept picking at it, but the... I have a scar now. <laughs> I would just wear a hoodie home and be like, I'm really cold. That's why, that's why I wore like uh, a more like covering shirt on last stream. Because I didn't want anybody to say anything. I swear to God, it's a fucking bug bite. But I know you little, you little shitters would say something. It's not a hickey. <laughs> Peace I do, Snicker. <laughs> Any other redeemers? Last call, last call. But why is chat on top of the camera? That's so dumb. I fixed it. 
Last call. But if you guys, if you have hickeys, there's apparently a cream that you can use to make bruises go away after like a day. Another indicator! If it was a hickey, I would have used the cream. Okay? Guys. You don't need to get your little detective fingers out. What cream? I forgot. I'll look up what it's called. My sister has it because since she donates plasma, sometimes she would get like crazy bruises after. It starts with a name. It's a cream for bruises. So we have that cream for her bruises she gets. But the fun of hickeys is to see them? No, you don't get it! The, the fun of hickeys is that way you see them in the mirror after you get out of the shower. You're like, haha, I had fun the other night. And then it's like a little secret. It's called... Arnicare. A-R-N-I-Care. Arnicare. Or Arnica, but the brand is called Arnica. You want others to see it too? No, you guys don't get it. You don't get it. Oh, wait, that's what you meant, Mac? Oh. <clears throat> I mean, I am living with my roommate, so it's not like they would care. <laughs> nah. Nah. Guys, 13 plus strength. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> What is going on? <laughs> I tell me. <laughs> Guys, want to hear a funny story? So this was with a previous partner. So, um, he was getting like hit on by like other women at work, and obviously, I don't care. I don't care. You know, as long as you come home to me, I don't care. I mean, they don't anymore. Anyway, so he was telling me how like all the like older women at work were like flirting with him and like staring at him. So he was like, can you give me a hickey? And I gave him like a huge one here. And then the rest of the day at work, like the woman did not talk to him. <laughs> so it worked. It was so funny. <laughs> it was hilarious. <laughs> Anyway, guys, I'll see you probably tomorrow. Tomorrow? I might do sub only or I might do a 9 to 5 stream. Depending on if I'm tired or not. I'm leaning more towards a 9 to 5. I don't know what game. Maybe? Maybe I'll do pressure washer sim, finally. The long requested, just kidding, nobody asked for it. <laughs> pressure washer stream. <laughs> okay. Like I said, guys, subscribe to the YouTube daily shorts and weekly stream highlights on the main channel. Subscribe to both channels. Do it. Screw it. Do it. Uh, one last thing. Oh, I will be doing a subathon for the last Saturday of September. So next Saturday. Oilers, get your credit cards ready. <laughs> Bet. Shut up. Shut up. You're so mean, man. I am ready. You better be. 12 hour cap subathon. I'm thinking I will start at like 10. Because I, I, I'd be fine streaming until 10. If it gets that far. We'll see. We'll see. Okay, I'll see you guys maybe tomorrow. Bye. Thank you all for hanging out. I appreciate it. I like Spirit Fair. Okay. Bye bye. Be well. I will. Wait, I gotta run an ad. Screw the non-subs. This is sub only time.
<clears throat> okay, I'll see you guys probably tomorrow. Bye-bye.